If you have water in your scene and you want to convey the depth of that water in your scene, all you have to do is add a volume absorption to your shader. Uh, for example, you can see what I have here. And see, we as when you go under the water, you get that nice gradient uh, that fades off into darkness as you look in the water. And uh, you simply, even when you change the color, just changes with it. So you can create some nice effects like so and uh, even when you look at at it from the top and uh, you can play with the depth here or density to make it brighter or less intense to make the effect less intense or more intense like that so let me show you how to set up the shader here so i'll just create a new project here and uh just going to add other shader just like so maybe scale it up scale it up like that and then create a new material let me go to object mode into material preview mode here and uh, i'll give it a uh, very little roughness to make it reflective give it a transformation and you can see by default how this looks it doesn't really look anything like water or anything like uh, with a depth of tweet so uh, let me also add some ripples just so to sell the effect going to add some buff maps and uh, a noise texture to it and uh, connect these like that let's give it a moment to compile and now we have the water but uh, it doesn't it lacks that depth even when you look at it inside here so I'm also just going to add the some surfaces here i'm just going to use my add-on here which you can get in the link in the description uh, makes it easier to add uh, objects or assets so let me add this so this surface here this ground surface just to convey the depth much easier and i show, show you what's going on You can see without the volume absorption this is how everything looks very very not depthy uh, so to make it have depth all you have to do is add a volume absorption shader so shader volume absorption and uh, connect that to the volume and uh, this works both in cycles and EV so yeah you can have it like that now, if we go in, we're starting to see something, but uh, if we increase this, we get that. Now, to make this look even much better in EV, you can turn on uh, screen space reflections and uh, refractions. And uh, for the material, you can go to the material settings and turn on screen space reflections. But uh, the water itself doesn't convey the depth we need. So we need to give it a color for the absorption. So something like greenish, some greenish color like that. And you can see we're starting to see something. And uh, if we sh make uh, the actual base color as well, the same color as this, and uh, to, so that we don't have many colors to change, we can add an input RGB and uh, connect this to this and this to that. So that we use only one color to affect everything. Now you can see now we have our depth. And now we can play with the density to make it darker or like that. So we can just you can see what we have. Now all that is left is adding fish. And it's good. Thank you.